Funeral services were held for local sports legend and Mountaintop Sports Director Teddy Painter on Saturday, April 27th. I got to, I started working with Teddy in January of 2023 in the sports world, but I worked with Teddy much longer when it was East Kentucky Broadcasting. And honestly, he was on the sidelines when I cheered in college and in the high school level as well. So I've kind of been around Teddy my entire sports career. But working with Teddy was a complete blessing because I had a really great mentor to really help guide me into the sports world from radio DJ to a sports reporter is a little bit different. So I'm lucky to have had somebody like Teddy Painter to guide me along the way. Teddy was beloved by not just his family and friends, but also his community, including the young athletes he worked to support and encourage throughout his life. Many attended the funeral to share in his memory and remember the legacy he leaves behind. Teddy worked in sports for 50 years and he has definitely left a legacy behind. When Teddy got so sick on us in January, the amount of kids, it didn't matter what sport it was, that would come up and just say, hey, how's Teddy? Hey, can we send Teddy a video? Hey, get a picture so you can send it to Teddy to let him know we're thinking of him and that we love him. He impacted so many children and so many athletes and some of those athletes that later became coaches that he's covered throughout his entire career. Teddy's loss is felt deeply within the community. Local sports will not be the same without him. For Mountaintop News, I'm Kelsey Fidel.